Hi guys, Mark is here and welcome to Chinese Entertainment Update, October 1st, 2023. I release episodes every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday between 7 and 10 p.m. Pacific Time. This is episode 745 and the rundown with timestamps is in the description box below. Now, because I use Chinese names quite a bit on my show, if you want the English spelling of them, you can turn on subtitles. I create them myself. In today's episode, Tiger and Crane with Jiang Long and Zhang Linghe confirms its premiere date. So does The Heart with Mark Chow, Rachel Mao, and Jing Sijia. Cheng Yi and Ellen Ren release statements addressing malicious rumors. And a Cao Rusi fan club says the actress is about to be announced for a new drama, but her fans are less than thrilled. We'll get to the top 10 Chinese web and TV dramas of the week as we do every Sunday. But first, here's what's recently premiered, one drama for today and the past few days. Embrace Love is a sci-fi modern drama starring Zhang Chao and Zhong Yanyuan. It premiered on September 30th. According to Yuku, in the drama, Zhong Yanyuan is a superstar from the future who suffers from a rare blood disease. She travels back in time to obtain blood from the only person who can save her, a genius scientist played by Zhang Chao, but inevitably falls for him. Embrace Love is slated for 20 episodes and is available on YouTube with English subs. That's it for what's recently premiered. Next up, here are a couple of dramas that recently confirmed their premiere dates. We begin with Tiger and Crane, a costume fantasy drama starring Jiang Long and Zhang Linghe. This is one of the cool posters they recently shared to confirm an October 2nd premiere. From the looks of it, Jiang Long is Tiger and Zhang Linghe is Crane. Jiang Long has had mostly supporting roles in his drama career, which began in 2015. I specifically remember his character as the bootlegger and loyal friend in 2021's Luoyang. Zhang Linghe is having a terrific 2023 so far, and that's despite the postponement of Story of Kunning Palace. Tiger and Crane will be his third drama this year, after My Journey to You and Bright Eyes in the Dark. According to Ai Qiyi, in Tiger and Crane, Jiang Long and Zhang Linghe are part of a team that participates in the selection of the National Imperial Demon Master. While there, they uncover a great conspiracy and seek to find the truth about the human-demon war that occurred hundreds of years ago. Tiger and Crane also stars Yuvin Wang and Julia Ye. The drama is slated for 36 episodes and will stream on iQiyi. Also confirming their premiere date recently, and I touched on this one in my last video, was The Heart. The Heart stars Mark Chow, Rachel Mao, and Jing Sijia. The modern medical drama recently confirmed an October 7th premiere. This is Mark Chow's first drama to air since 2021's The Ideal City. He is notoriously selective of his projects. Rachel Mao's last drama to air was this year's The Ingenious One, whereas Jing Sijia's was last year's Rising Lady. In the heart, Mark Chow is the deputy chief physician of cardiology at a hospital. He is strict and disciplined and a stark contrast to Jing Sijia, an outspoken and impulsive doctor whom he has to partner with. Rachel Mao is Mark's sister who becomes a doctor in the ICU. The Heart is slated for 38 episodes and will stream on Tencent. That's it for premiere dates. Moving on, a couple of new trailers and pictures to update on. Beginning with a love story of oiled paper umbrella. The costume drama stars Yu Menglong and Li Zixuan, and on September 21st, they shared their first trailer. When you eventually get married, your master, I, will make an umbrella to fetch you, says Yu Menglong in the opening of the trailer, which showcases a romance filled with bliss and heartache. Yu Menglong last starred in Wonderella's Diary, which aired earlier this year. Li Zixuan has had mostly supporting roles recently. Her last lead role was in 2021's Gourmet and Tang Dynasty. Here are the two at the booting ceremony in June. And here they are at the wrap two months later. In a love story of oiled paper umbrella, he is the master and she the apprentice as they hunt demons together. The drama is slated for 24 episodes and will stream on iQiyi. White Cat Legend, a costume drama starring Ryan Ding and Zhou Qi, also shared their first trailer. In the drama, Ryan is Li Bing, the white cat leader of the Dali Temple. He has the ability to turn into a white cat. 
He and his team members, which consist of Zhou Qi and Miles Wei among others, unravel different kinds of mysteries in this story set in the Tang Dynasty. White Cat Legend wrapped their four-month film shoot in December last year. Ryan last starred in Love You Seven Times, the recently aired costume drama with Yang Xiaoyue. Zhou Qi, on the other hand, starred in a modern drama which came out earlier this year, Who's Your Daddy? White Cat Legend is slated for 36 episodes and will stream on iQiyi. And that's it for drama updates, celebrity updates now, and today we begin with a couple of celebrity statements, first by Cheng Yi Studio. On September 28th, the 33-year-old actress Reps took to Weibo to say, among other things, Recently, we noticed that some netizens maliciously fabricated false information and infringed on Mr. Cheng Yi's reputation rights. We will continue to pay attention to such vicious rumors, do a good job in preserving evidence, and reserve the right to pursue legal action. They then reminded everyone that Cheng Yi recently received a judgment in his favor after a dispute with a rumor monger who had to pay a compensation which Cheng Yi has decided to donate. They also shared a lawyer's letter that speaks to the malicious rumors. Apparently, the infringer had taken some of Cheng Yi's voice messages from a fan group years ago and creatively edited them to create a fake narrative about him. Also releasing a statement recently was Ellen Ren Studio. On September 28th, the 34-year-old actor's reps shared a statement to say that recent rumors involving Ellen with prostitution, infidelity, divorce, second child, etc. are false. Quote, Mr. Ren Jialun has never engaged in the above-mentioned behavior, unquote. They added that they have entrusted lawyers with the matter and will hold those responsible accountable. Next up, Steffi Chi took to Weibo to respond to some of the comments regarding one of her recent fashion choices. On September 28th, a short video clip featuring Steffi Chi in Paris circulated social media. In it, she is modeling a dress and a bag, and what caught netizens' attention was the sharp shoulder pads that Steffi fashioned. The topic, Steffi Chi Sharp Angled Shoulder, started making the rounds on Weibo, with many netizens saying it wasn't the best look for her. The 38-year-old actress addressed the comments, saying, I saw the trending topic. The sharp angled shoulders are indeed a very unique and memorable design of the brand. I like it very much. But don't worry, my lovelies, I don't have sharp shoulders. Mine are round. Steffi last starred in Under the Microscope, the costume drama with Chang Ruoyun that came out earlier this year. Lastly now for celebrity updates, just a quick melon to share. You guys can make of it what you will. Rumor has it that a new Cao Lu Si drama will be announced, but some fans aren't thrilled to say the least. A Cao Lu Si fan club posted this earlier today. It says, October 2nd, 10 o'clock, new project announcement at Zhu Lian Yumu. Incidentally, this video will be uploaded on October 2nd, 10 o'clock, China time, so in fact, right now we would know if the project was indeed announced or not. Anyway, Zhu Lian Yumu is a rumored upcoming costume drama that at the moment has been given the English title The Legend of Jewelry. Although it has an official Weibo page, it hasn't officially announced its stars yet. On Douban, however, it is slated for a 2025 release, and it lists Zhao Lu Si, Liu Yuning, and Qu Xu Xiao as its stars. On the fan club's post, followers lined up to show their disapproval, with the top comment pointing the finger at Zhao Lu Si's agency, YHKY Media. There were calls to boycott the drama. Zhao Lu Si is not a tool to sew wedding dresses for others, exclaimed one fan, perhaps alluding to the sentiment that the actress is above the project. If the rumored cast materializes, it reunites Zhao Lu Si and Liu Yuning, who were both in the 2021 costume drama The Long Ballad. And that's it for celebrity updates. Before we get to this week's top 10, just to say that this show wouldn't be possible without you guys tuning in, so I thank you all for your support. If you enjoy the content, do like and subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell button for notifications. If you'd like to contribute, consider giving this video a super thanks. It is the heart-shaped button with a dollar sign below this video. All funds support the show and keep it going. Or you can check out my Patreon page, where for a dollar or more a month, you'll have access to parts like recaps, requests, and have your questions answered. On that note, it's Sunday today, so time for the Top 10 Chinese Dramas of the Week, Edition 191, October 1st, 2023.
The data is provided by V-Linkage, a marketing consultant company based in Shanghai. They provide top drama charts every day. In this segment, the drama standings are based on their 7-day total points, beginning last Sunday and ending yesterday. We begin with the top 10 web dramas. The list is based on view counts on Youku, Aichii, and Tencent, social media discussions, and Baidu searches. Number 10. The Legend of Zhuo Hua The costume drama stars Qing Tian and Feng Shaofeng Number 9. Mysterious Lotus Casebook The costume drama stars Cheng Yi, Joseph Cheng, and Aero Xiao Number 8. Stand By Me The modern drama stars Angel Zhao and Bai Yufan Number 7. My Journey to You The costume drama stars Esther Yu and Zhang Linghe Number 6. South Wind Knows The modern drama stars Cheng Yi and Zhang Yixi Number 5. I Am Nobody The modern drama stars Peng Yichang and Neo Ho Number 4. Faithful the costume drama stars Janice Wu and Li Jiahang. Number 3. Hilarious Family. The costume drama stars Liu Lin and Jackie Lee. Number 2. Parallel World. The modern drama stars Nini and Bai Yu. And number 1. Bright Eyes in the Dark. The modern drama stars Johnny Huang and Zhang Jingyi. Bright Eyes in the Dark is championed for the first time since its premiere. It garnered 562 points. Next up, here are the top 10 Chinese TV dramas of the week. The list is based on TV ratings and social media discussions in China. Number 10, The Nest, the Republican era drama stars Han Dong and Song Yi. Number 9, Winter and Lion, the military drama stars Du Chuan and Wang Ziqi. Number 8, Against the Light, the modern drama stars Shang Han Yu and Lyric Lan. Number 7, Love in the Green Mountains, the modern drama stars Li Jian and Zhu Rui. Number 6, The Eve, the Republican era drama stars Oh Hao and Zhang Hui Wen. Number 5, Incomparable Beauty, the modern drama stars Chen Xiao and Gu Li Naja. Number 4, A Long Way Home, the modern drama stars Zhang Wanyi and Guo Tao. Number 3, Spy Game, the modern drama stars Han Keng and Wei Da Xun. Number 2, Sunshine by My Side, the modern drama stars Xiao Zhan and Bai Bai He. And number 1, Alliance, the modern drama stars Zhang Xiaofei and Huang Xiaoming. Alliance ends the week with 593 points, making it champion for the first time since its premiere. There it is guys, hope this gives you an idea of what dramas are hot in Chinese drama land at the moment. Tune in again next week to see how your favorite dramas perform. That brings us to the end of this episode, have a great week ahead and I'll see you guys Tuesday. As always, stay safe and I wish you clear blue skies, good health and happiness. Until next time, cheers!